啦啦。Hello, peeps, and welcome back to My Sims Extra, the series where we do all the little things in My Sims that doesn't really quite fit into the main series. Today is a bit of a different one. Today, I will share with you how you can get all 24 exclusive essences um, that were available in the PC version of My Sims via the online garden feature. The garden was an online feature that was only available in My Sims PC. Once you reach star level 2, you could climb onto the train and travel to the garden. Your garden would have a small selection of these exclusive essences. The idea, much like Animal Crossing and fruit trees, was to travel to friends' gardens and collect the other exclusive essences until you had all 24 of them. Unfortunately, the online feature was closed a long time ago. Um, you can still go to your garden and get your exclusive essences, but you can no longer gain the missing ones from visiting friends' gardens. You can't, you can't visit their gardens anymore. And as a side note, you can no longer actually get these uh, exclusive emotes that you used to be able to collect as well. That doesn't work anymore. Um, if you want to know more about the garden, I do actually have a My Sims Extra episode uh, called the garden <laughs> so you can always watch that to find out more about it that said a peep came to me a little while ago called Odie and they said maybe there is something that we can do in the code of the game that lets us get these exclusive essences I have no idea why this had never occurred to me before but I took that idea and I ran with it and later that day I not only had all the exclusive essences myself but I also informed Odie how he could get them too and now he has all of the exclusive essences in his game of my sims as well and this video is me telling all of you how you can get them too ha ha yes in the description below is a link to a document that i have written um, and i've made it available for viewing in your browsers uh, via my onedrive so if you click on the link you will be able to view this document as you can see here and on here you will see all the exclusive essences listed next to game code that I've pre-written for you all. Um, note there is a number in each line. I have made the number one all the way down. This is the amount of that essence that you will receive. So if you want 50 of an essence, change that one to a 50 um, and you can put, and then you would get 50 of that essence. You can put anything from one to 99 in that slot. So you have the code, but where do you put it? When you install My Sims the game, it will create a folder in your user documents, which commonly can be found in your C drive, users, then your username, whatever that might be, mine is Blala, then documents. In there, you should see a folder called Electronic Arts. This may have a few game folders in it, like The Sims 3, um, like mine does, but we want the My Sims folder. Open that to see something like this. We can ignore everything except the saved data folders. I have two saved data folders because I have two saved games in my sims. I know that I want the exclusive essences in my main game, which is this one. Because that is the first saved game, logically, it is the save data one folder. Let's open it. We are only interested in one file here, player record, XML. Now, before we change anything, I strongly recommend you make a copy of this file as a backup and save it somewhere safe. This way, should you decide to revert back to your original saved game, you are free to do so by saving the original file back over the amended one. Because I have no idea what programs you have on your PC, there is a very good chance that when you click to open this player record file, it will be opened in Notepad, which will look horrid and confusing, and this is impossible to work with. Blah. I recommend Notepad++. It is like Notepad. It's free, it's easy to use, download, uh, but it understands code when it sees it and lays it out all nice for us, much easier to read. 
I have included a link in the description below so that you can download Notepad++ free and safely. And if you're not sure how to install that, I mean, it's super easy. It's super easy. You just click click on the link and, and it even has a link that says, if you don't know what you're doing, download it with this link and then you install it. And we only want to view this file, all these little tick boxes and extra features, just, we don't want any of that. We just want the simple installation of Notepad++. But you can always go onto YouTube and, and search how to install Notepad++ if you want or find out more about it. So on our file, we can get the quick menu up and we can put, let's open with Notepad++. Ah, much better even color coded to make it so it's not only a nicer layout but it's even color coded so we can break up the code and see everything nice and easy and this is a big file and we want um, what we want is about halfway down let's find it nice and quick press Control F to open the find box and type in a name of a simple essence you know you have um, Apple is a good one on mine it has jumped to Apple black which is perfect. This is the table we are looking for. See how the code looks the same to the one in my file. This table lists all the essences you currently have in the game, along with how many of that essence you have. You are free at this point to think, hmm, I know these chocolate cakes are a real pain to get. Let's see, I have find cake. There, chocolate cake. I have four. Um, do, 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 do. 99 <laughs> you can save that start the game and see you have 99 chocolate cakes easy well we want a whole bunch of essences we don't currently have so you want to copy the code from my file and then paste it into your player record into this table you can paste it anywhere in this table at the start the end the middle the order is of no consequence but you must make sure that the spacing matches so that once you've pasted the new code into the original table, that it all looks the same and matches. This one looks perfect. Once happy with all the number of each essence, you can save this and close it. And now you start your game. Ta-da! Every exclusive essence with an extra tip on how to cheat yourself as many of any essence you want into the game. I was recently asked by a peep the purpose of the lift inside the hotel because if you click on it you receive this message kind of suggests there is something going on here while poking around in the files i found this hotel interior upstairs <gasps> there is a secret here and i am determined to find it and if i am successful i will be absolutely sure to share that secret with you until then i think it's time for bed isn't it blala it's time for bed isn't it yes it is time for bed ah. thank you for watching i hope you've enjoyed the episode if you did please hit that like button as long as you are here why not check out one of my delectable videos available feel free to come stalk me on social media and be sure to share this video with friends so even more may watch my shizwa. See you next time, peeps.